What is good everyone, it is your boy Attach, and today we are back with a brand new video. I will be showing you how to play slow like a pro player. Earlier, or I think last week I uploaded a video titled How to Play Aggressive Like a Pro Player. It did really well, you guys loved it, you asked for more, so I got you. I know a lot of you like to play fast, and I know a lot of you like to play slow. So you gotta, you gotta make both sides happy, so thank you all very much for watching another video. If you could, make sure that like button and subscribe before we get into the tips and tricks, because when you're playing like a slow professional player, you will be using an AR. Right now, the M4 is the best AR in the game, so that's what everyone will be using. That's what you should be using too. Even though your friends might roast you, people in the pubs might roast you as well, but if you're getting all the kills and you're winning all the games, who really cares what they're saying? So uh, let's get right into these tips and tricks, and I'll show you guys how to play slow like a professional player. What I always recommend in my videos is always start the day off with a nice little free-for-all. Get the movement on point, get the slides around, and make sure you are absolutely beaming and not missing any bullets with the gun you're using. Uh, it's really fun to use the M4. It just kills so quick. It aims in really fast it's a do-it-all gun along with mp5 two best guns in modern warfare far and away but i would just like to do this just to get to my movement warm get my shot warm get my pre-aims warm and all that good stuff because i'm not i don't want to go into these pubs cold if you're going into games cold you're usually not going to play too well and you can't be doing that you can't be costing the team but make sure you get the slides on point the yy's get a little fancy with it have some have some swag in game oh no okay there we go Oh, I thought we were about to die right there. Oh, we're going to die here. I know ammo. No, and we just died there. And oh my god, you hate to see that. But you want to always be pre-aimed up. You never want to get caught on pre aimed Because if you're not pre-aiming with this gun, it's very hard. Like, the fire is not very good. You see that? Like, it just it just didn't work out too well. The hip fire, it was not too good at all. I do not recommend you hip fire with the ARs. I want to make sure you're always pre-aimed. And if you're ever caught off guard, you're not pre-aiming. It's not gonna go too well for you. It's not like the MP5 where the first the first hip hard bullet is always gonna hit. But if it does, you'll be very lucky. So always be sure to always be pre-aiming and never get caught lacking. There are certain ways you should be challenging things with an AR. Let's say someone is in that left side of the window right there. Instead of just going like this and trying to like pre-aim around the corner and do that, which he will see you first because you're crouching around slowly, he's gonna see your body before you full peek the corner. It, it do this, run around the corner and hit a jump. Bang, snap on him. That's what you want to do. Just get practice your jumps around the corners. You will camera him, and you're going to get the first bullet off. If your first bullet connects, you will win that gunfight unless you just start bricking after that. So make sure you're retaking the corners like this and not slow like this with your AR because that will just get you killed. And there's just certain spots like random off angles like this on top of this hut. Just look at this doorway to get free kills. We see in the top bricks window. There's really just certain spots on certain maps where you can just take over the whole map, hold the really weird cross angles that you couldn't do with an MP5 because the MP5 is good at all ranges, but at long range, it's the M4 just completely destroys it at long range as it should. So there's a lot of re weird and different spots you could play with the M4 to just overlook things like this spot right here, look into windows, anything. There's just so much possibilities and variety you can do with this weapon instead of just having to run up and head bash like you are when you use the MP5 or another SMG. You have to play very strategical and smart and never get caught sprinting when you're using the M4. Here are the attachments I will be using on my gun today. And guys, I know, I know it's the M4 and the MP5 every other video, but these guns are so good and people love them. So like you just have to use it. And if I'm making a video talking about what pro players pl do, how they play, I don't want to lie to you guys and say they don't use the M4 and MP5 because those guns are honestly insane. But here are my attachments once more. The Compensator. Corvus Custom. And someone actually asked in my video the other day, why do you use the Corvus over the stock M16 Grenadier? Because the stock M16 aims in slightly slower. And uh, whenever I'm running around, I want to be having the Corvus on because I just think it feels better to aim in quicker. So that's my personal preference on it. And then we have the Commando foregrip, the Stipple Grip Tape, and no stock. Let's get around to the pubs. Let's get it. We are joining you, Frady's Bridge, late. And I, don't, I do not like what I'm seeing right now. We are down 0 to 50 or 0 to 50. That's just not what you'd like to see. But we're going to go take the power positions over on the map because that is first and foremost the most important part about playing like a pro player. Taking over the important spots where you know people are going to be. When we're in a, in a spot like this, where we're going to get sniped at, okay, the little long shot right there. Oh, okay, let's go. A little, little four-piece action. But you always want to be on the highest point of the... Oh, what the heck? I, was, I just got... Mm, I just got airstriked. I was going to say, you always want to be at the highest point of the map, and the headquarters is 
in our building right now. So that means they have to come towards us, which is very good for us. Wait, I'll, let me be a team player and take this UAV down or this counter UAV down. But right now, when you're playing objective game mode, the headquarters is here. The other team is going to try and win, and to win, they have to capture the headquarters. So that means they're about to run towards us, and we're about to get free kills. So get posted up near the headquarters or the objective or whatever game mode you're playing. And look at they're just sprinting down at me. The freest three piece of my life. Okay, this guy is shooting rockets across the map. This guy's a savage. He over there? Yeah, I see him. Oh, and then was he on the bridge? Oh, you climbed up and saw me. No, now I just. Oh my God. And we're talking about playing a or playing slow like a pro player. So what better game mode to do that in than the CDL playlist? And we are posted up. We got a little two piece. Okay, that's a good way to start the game. Oh, CJ. You do not want to peek that again. May kill my teammate. May kill. Okay, he's gone to the hill. He gone to the hill. Oh my god, we're breaking. We're breaking. All right, we're good. We made up for it. Oh, CJ, you gotta win those. You gotta win those, brother. All right, we actually only have three bullets left, so this is very unfortunate. But I am going to try and knife a guy. Come on, come on. <laughs> okay. I got scavenger. Oh, I need the ammo. Oh no, man. Okay, we gotta pick up another gun. <laughs> oh, dude, are you serious? I didn't get a gun and we were absolutely frying right there. But you gotta know where the hills are rotating, which is very important. But you also wanna hold the power positions on the map. Okay, being up on the sandbags, that's a power spot. Being behind head glitches on. Oh, that Shrook guy actually had a pretty good shot. But being behind head glitches. Those are power spots, and then there's obviously some spots that are better than others on the certain maps because you can just hold a whole lane down. Uh, my right's open, but this is a very good spot right here if you can get up. Oh, that's why it's not a good spot when your right's open, but if your right is being watched by your teammates, then you can just stay posted up there. You have a crazy head glitch. Look over to the dark cave. I'm just trying to show you guys some, some good positioning, some good angles. What the hell? Did I just get sniped? Bro, that was an instant red hit marker pretty much. That was actually insane. Let's go. Oh, there's a kill right there. I'm kind of sad that I didn't stay there. We're going back towards the middle of the map. Oh, there we go. There he is. We're going to go towards the god spot. My teammate is on right now. He just got taken off. Oh, CJ. He's pushing us aggressive. Thank God for the trades on my teammates. The guys are playing against are actually pretty decent. But now that I'm actually posted up on the heady, we're good. There we go, that's one. Who is this guy channel like that? What the heck? He was feeling a little too confident. Come on, I'm on, I'm on the spot. I'm on the rock spot over here. Oh, this guy is feeling himself. Who is he channel like this? I am, I am genuinely confused. Oh wait, 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 wait. plays. Oh, he didn't see it coming. Never saw it coming. Next level plays. Okay, CJ did though. He saw the flank coming in hot. Those were next level plays right there. Smoke yourself out. Lay in the smoke. That's why using smoke to your advantage is so good. Oh, CJ, come on. I didn't like to play aggr play aggressive in flank. I'm not letting you flank my team though. Okay, there we coming from the left heavy. Already at the desk. Oh, he's one shot. He takes this guy off the desk right here. Can't see through the smoke. There we go. That's one. Hurt. Oh, I see him hitting in her. The two hitting in her. There we go again with no ammo. Not what we like. Need ammo. Need ammo. Okay. Every time we're dying, we just run out of ammo. I'm getting my body shot. These people are just so lucky that I don't have ammo right now. Because when I do have ammo, you see what's happening. You're peeping the beams, right? Oh, he's behind me. Oh, he's behind me, bro. He just climbed up sandbag. Where's my teammates? Oh, they're all over there. Wow, this guy is posted. These guns are really that easy to shoot. This guy, I know I was hurt and all, but these guys are hitting pretty good shots. 
Okay. Okay. I don't know what these guys are doing. Never gonna get four pieced. Definitely not gonna get three pieced by one nade though. I know from I know that from experience. Is it that, are you seriously pushing the old hill with that little that little time? I don't know about that one, Chief. No, we got pinched out. Oh, okay. We got to rotate to the next two. We got to rotate. We got to rotate. We got to rotate. Oh, we spawn. We are spawning far away. You never want to get these spawns right here. He made it with the win, though. You'd love to see that. Okay. Got your trades, teammate. Oh, I, I got your trades. We got the trades back. All right, we're just trading back and forth. Oh, CJ is flanking the back like CJ always likes to do. I've caught this guy flanking like 8,000 times. One is in the doggy, I'm pretty sure. Smoked it out, that's a good play. I think my teammate just naded me. Not gonna lie. Oh, now we're spawning far out. This is actually not good. You guys can actually, I can actually bring it back right now. All right, we gotta go to new. If we don't go to new, we're gonna lose. Cause this is a full 60 hill. You need to know. You need to know when to rotate. Rotating is very important. Getting to the new hill first, being able to hold it, and we get shot in the back. You guys are rotating. Rotate better than some pros. They just posted up back yellow, looking for me. Oh, this is actually going to be a close game. Good smoke. But teammate, we could do this. No, one stop. One's in fifth. One stop sandbag. Getting into yellow. Got to clutch over the squad right here. There we go. Did not mean to throw that smoke. That smoke's gonna get me killed. When all else fails, close the door. My hip fire did not work. Oh, we came back. Oh, I thought my teammates were gonna kill him. I would have got an assist though, I'm an idiot. Oh, he's bottom blue. Yo, these guys are actually about to win. Alright, we have 11 seconds. We just gotta rotate and get into new. You mate, you just gave up the hill time? Oh my gosh. I got front baited so hard. Uh, in the new hill. There's absolutely no way we lose this. Yeah, that pushed out. Smoked us, which is actually we stay in the hill. We gotta stay in the hill. Guys. No way. It's not happening right now. Oh, he's one shot in the dark. We gotta clutch up for the squad. If we get out of the hill, we win, by the way. I don't know if my teammates realize that. Go. Oh, that's not. Let's not go. Oh my god, that was the most intense hectic game ever. But we did it. We clutched up. Shout out to the squad for clutching up that. If you guys made it to the end, thank you for watching. You're a real one. I appreciate you. Uh, and as always, my name's attached, and I'm out. Peace.